Hi folks, Max from GalaxyS5Root.com. Today we're going to learn how to unlock the Sprint Hotspot on your Sprint Galaxy S5 SMG 900P. Uh, so, you must first have a rooted uh, phone, obviously, so make sure, go ahead and root your Sprint Galaxy S5. If you don't know how, just go to my site, GalaxyS5Root.com. Um, check the FAQ at the top, you'll be able to find the link to rooting your Galaxy S5. Once rooted, um, let me go ahead and show you what happens if I try to turn the hotspot on right now. Um, you'll obviously get turn it on for a second, and then you get this thing. Oh, you're not subscribed. All right, screw you. Um, phone, I'm going to go ahead and uh, go ahead and download this file. Uh, also, this version, uh, make sure, in, if you're watching this in the future, way in the future, make sure you have the correct version. Uh, go to buy, about device. Uh, make sure your build number is ends in NCB. I don't know if you can see that. Let me go ahead and make this a little bit brighter for you. There we go. Make sure it says NCB just like that. Uh, if you have NCB, you're good to go. If you have some other version, um, I should have an update. So go check my site. I should have an updated version uh, that you can use. And this is actually, I didn't make it, uh, it's by XDA user Mike D 63017 I'll have a donate link to uh, on my site, so make sure you donate if you are thankful that you have a hotspot working. Um, so go ahead and reboot into recovery. I'm going to go ahead and power down my phone and reboot into uh, my Clockwork Mod recovery manually. And also you do have to use the Clockwork Mod CWM root method and install CWM. If you use CF Auto. Uh, CF auto root then uh, go ahead and refollow the directions on how to root your phone um, and install clock mod recovery or tour recovery uh, once powered off go ahead and go into your recovery by holding that volume up center home and the power uh, when you see the recovery booting once in clock mod recovery go ahead and go to the install from zip option uh, let me go ahead and do this so you can see a little bit better uh, your menus might be different if you're using a Torp or another version of Qualcomm Mod Recovery. Just go ahead and install from zip and go ahead and find the zip file, uh, unlock hotspot 1.2.zip. You should have downloaded this to your phone first, of course. Um, I forgot to show you that, but um, go ahead and download it. I'll have the download link on my site. Um, go ahead and install this, and that's it. Go ahead and reboot, and your uh, Sprint hotspot should be uh, working. Also, I do highly recommend disable recovery flash, otherwise you may lose your clock remote recovery upon reboot, uh, which the Samsung system does. Anyway, I'll be back when this completely boots. All right, let's go into settings and turn on our Wi-Fi hotspot. So let's go here, go to hotspot, go ahead and turn it on, and let's check if it actually works. It works, no errors. Uh, let me go ahead and connect it uh, from my Note 3, which I've got here, and let's try that. And I'm going to go ahead and connect to the SMG 900P. Uh, there we go, 650 all right and my lte sprint really sucks so it's really really slow um but i'm connected now as you can see there and yep my internet is working let me just enter some random numbers and there you have it now you will be able to uh get a free hotspot tethering working on your sprint galaxy s5 again my lte's i just get barely one bar here that's why it's super slow Sometimes it just doesn't work. Uh, I don't know why Sprint really failed lately. I think they've removed some of my LTE towers around my house. Um, anyway, uh, so go ahead and check it out and get your free hotspot. And as always, if you have a Galaxy S5, don't forget to subscribe to my email list at galaxyS5root.com. And I will see you guys soon. As always, stay high on Android. And uh, don't forget to check out my video of my... A wireless charger you can also get for the Galaxy S5. Now it's charging. Cool. All right, see y'all later.